joining me on the Vodafone stand is Eric Bernays, CEO for Vodafone IoT. So naturally, we're going to be talking all things IoT. But first things first, how are you? I'm doing great, thank you. Super exciting show, great stand, couldn't be better. Now, a little birdie tells me it's been a very busy 12 months for you guys over at Vodafone IoT. So talk to me, what's been happening? What's the change that's been happening? Talk me through, tell me everything. Absolutely, I mean, we've had so much change this year. First of all, in the market, the market has continued to grow. Internally, we have actually founded Vodafone IoT. It's a 100% owned Vodafone company, but with all the IoT people and resources in one company, and that gives us three advantages. Number one, we are much more focused this way. Number two, we have more financial flexibility and are investing more into our services. Yes. And number three, we can actually not only serve customers in Vodafone countries optimally, but all around the world because we're expanding a lot more into the world. I think that's just a testament to how much, how far the IoT industry is growing, which brings yeah. me on to my next question. Yeah. You know, here at MWC, yeah. there's so much talk about IoT. Yeah. So tell me why you think it's so prominent and why yeah. now? So basically, when you look around at the Vodafone stand, but everywhere at all the other stands, you see IoT everywhere. It's actually connected to AI because AI is the big buzzword this year as well. But artificial intelligence is nothing without the data to make sense of it. So AI is the brain and IoT are the nerves which take the data from the sensors to AI. And that's why IoT is now not a niche market anymore. It's a really big market and absolutely necessary for AI and everything else. And you can see that on all the stands around us. I think that's a great analogy that you just gave as well, because it's so true, isn't it? You know, there's interconnected infrastructure. Yeah. Um, and finally, what is on the horizon for yeah. Vodafone IoT? Yeah. What you can tell us anyway. No, 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 I'm, I'm very happy to tell us our big plans, which is to get a lot bigger, to hyperscale, to go out everywhere in the world, to basically do um, uh, all kinds of things for our customers, help them to grow their businesses, but also we're especially proud of the sustainability. For example, we are measuring how much CO tons of CO2 our customers save by through our connectivity. And last year that was 32.7 million tons. So we'll continue that, we will grow. And how are we going to do that? We're going to do that by making sure that we continue to always have a lot more networks available than everybody else. That's the case today. Always having the newest technologies. For example, this year we've added the, the ability to locally serve our customers in United Arab Emirates, Saudi Arabia. We're going to do more of this. And ultimately our slogan is, we can do anything to connect everything to improve people's lives and businesses. And that's what we're going to do. So it feels like this is almost like almost like the beginning of the journey. There's still so much more to That's achieve. Right. All right. Well, I wish you the best of luck. Thank you know, you it's an much. impressive market. And I'm sure you guys are going to completely nail it. Thank you. Thank Thanks, you. Eric. Thank you. <laughs>